This is Sunday Live at Arena Hua Hin with Lee Higgins. Hey, I'm very excited to have my special guest, Dr. Pim. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. (laughs) Sardika. Now, Dr. Pim, you're here to talk to us about laughing yoga. (laughs) That's right. (laughs) Every time I say laughing yoga, I start laughing. Yeah, (laughs) that's the magic of it. (laughs) I'm funny about that. But before we get into that, tell us a little bit about you. How long have you been here in Hua Hin? Um, I've been here about almost two years now. Okay. Yeah. You're a doctor. So, uh, you know, where are you from originally? Um, I'm from Bangkok, yeah. And where did you study? Well, my study history is a little bit complicated. So, actually, I started studying psychology uh, in New Zealand. Ah. And that was my bachelor. And then, after working for a little bit, I was like, nah, I want to be a doctor. So, (laughs) I told my mother and she was like, okay, go ahead. So, I did my medical degree in Poland. Really? Yep. So you've gone from Thailand, New Zealand, Poland, to Poland and, then, <laughs> and then I came back here to get my license and then I started practicing. Yeah. Yeah. So what part of New Zealand did you um, did you study? Um, I was in Wellington, the capital. Yeah. Mm, I love Wellington. Yeah. A lot more sheep than people. <laughs> <laughs> Where are all the people? Yeah. <laughs> well, that, yeah, well, New Zealand is known for a sheep, but mm. Wellington is such a beautiful, beautiful it's, it's town. It's a very nice place. Probably a little bit sleepy for a capital. Uh, yeah, especially when you come from Bangkok. Absolutely. Uh, what a culture shock. Yeah, yeah. On the first day I arrived, I arrived around five or six, and I was like, oh, I need to go do some shopping to buy beddings, but all the shopping malls were closed. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> What's going on here in New yeah. Zealand? Yeah. <laughs> and so you you studied in Poland, worked in Poland? Uh, no, I just uh, finished my medical degree okay. and then I flew back here. And how many languages do you speak? Oh, quite quite a few. So maybe five now. Really? What are they? So Thai and English. I'm fluent. Mm-hmm. I speak some Polish because I was in Poland. Mm-hmm. I did learn Chinese in high school and Spanish. I, I learned in school as well. And I'm learning German right now. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like, why not? <laughs> why not? <laughs> There's just lots of German patients here. So I was like, I uh, might as well pick it up. Why not? So what have you been doing here in Hua Hin? So I actually moved here uh, for work. Mm-hmm. So currently I'm working as a GP at like Bewo Medical Center. Yes. So yeah, I, I found this job and I was like, I love it. I'm going to move here. And I did. <laughs> <laughs> and Hoi Hin's such a great town to, to live and work in, isn't it? Well, it's a little bit quiet, but for the job, I was like, yeah, I'll yeah. be here. I'll, yeah. I'll just come. Like, it's a great job, great place. And yeah. And so how did you get into laughing yoga? Um, how do I get into laughing yoga? It's a very good question. So, uh, first of all, I, at the clinic, like I take care of like a lot of like mental health patients and, um, my mother knows this. And then one day my mother came to me and I was like, she was like, Oh, uh, I've been to a laughing yoga session with your father. My father started laughing by himself in front of the mirror every morning. I was like, what's going on? And she was like, you, you got to go, you got to go. It's got to be like very good for the patients and stuff. Right. I have no idea what it was. And I was like, okay, whatever mom says is always the right thing. Yes, <laughs> why good not? On you. Yeah, why like, not? Okay, I'll, I'll go. Yeah. And so that's how it started. That was just December last year. You're not into yoga normally? Um, not really. I mean, I do it occasionally, and but not like a big yoga fan and stuff. Yeah. But... And I mean, what is laughing yoga, you know? (laughs) So what is it? Tell us what it is (laughs) without laughing, right? Actually, um, it doesn't really have anything to do with yoga at all. Um, It's it's like a misnomer a little bit. So it's more like laughing exercises. But the yoga part is just like the deep breath, the deep breathing and stuff. That's, That's why they call it laughing yoga. Right. I was... Imagining sitting in the lotus position or and doing so, and <laughs> no, no, yeah, that, that's what I thought that people may think that it is that, but yeah. it's actually not. So basically, you you do these like poses, uh, not not like body poses, but just like funny poses, and then you're laughing for ten to fifteen minutes, which right? Is, and then you. That's that, yeah. So it sounds like everybody can, you don't have to be flexible to do no, this. No, no, it's for like for all ages, all sex, uh, all nationalities, any and everyone can do it. And you said your father's been doing it. Yeah, my father, he's like 70. Mm-hmm. He's, you know, gray hair and everything. And he just laughed by himself in front of the mirror. He was just like <laughs> brushing his teeth and be like, ha 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 ha. <laughs> so that's, the, that's what it is, yeah. 
So tell us a little bit about what this session is going to do. Uh, now, you're doing it on March the 9th, is that right? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Um, so in the session, we're, we're going to do a laughing session, basically. So um, first we're going to do with a, like a, some warm-up hand hand clapping e exercises and then after that we'll enter the the exercise itself so i'm gonna lead some some very easy pose that has nothing to do with the body right and then we'll just laugh it out and <laughs> yeah and then with some cool deep breath exercise and that's it that's the session oh, <laughs> i know every time i say laughing yoga the funny thing that happens is i start smiling or start giggling <laughs> like a child is that what happens uh usually yeah people look at me funny and be like what's laughing yoga <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stuff like that. so what are the benefits of doing laughing oh, yoga there are so many benefits um uh, first of all, it elevates your mood, mm. and this is great if you're, you know, a little bit sad, depressed, or if you're anxious, those kind of things, because it really adjusts the chemicals in your brain, mm -hmm. especially if you, like, do it daily on a daily basis. It also has, like, many other benefits, like, it stimulates the blood flow, like, around the body. It also, there, there is actually a research that it also helps lower the blood sugar okay. after you eat food. And yeah, and all about the connection between people. There are plenty, plenty benefits, and it's free. Yeah, it's and free. <laughs> well, I think also people are looking for alternatives to taking the traditional medicine. And I mm. know you're a doctor, and yeah. you know how to treat people. But there is also what are the things that you can do that doesn't need a pill or an injection yeah, certainly, and that type of thing? Yeah, certainly, Because, like, you know, in, in modern days, a lot of people put focus on the external stuff, mm. like the medication, surgery and stuff. But the internal stuff is, like, neglected. Mm. And, like, the emotional well-being and those kind of things, it's, it's actually very important for the body to recover and you know to to stay healthy and laughing yoga is certainly one easy way for for anyone to to do it at home for free with any age and any background yeah because i was just going to ask that for any age because you know children go through mm -hmm. a whole heap of different things as well yeah. as adults yeah. so is it good for all ages yeah for all ages um uh, so the poses and exercises are slightly different for people of different age because um, I try to make the exercises so that it incorporates the poses in, in like daily life. So say if the people participating are of older adults, then the pose would be like a joint pain pose, those kind of thing. Right. Whereas uh, if it's more like a young young audience and we would be doing like animal poses and those kind of things. Right. Yeah. Sometimes people don't want to... Um I suppose talk about it too yeah, much. Yeah, yeah. It's actually, <clears throat> sorry. Mm. It's, it's actually very, very common. Um, uh, a lot more common than than we think, mm. and especially because like I deal with this type of cases at the clinic. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it, it should be normalized, and there is really no shame or anything in asking for help. Mm. Like there's medication. There are al also other things that you can do at home, like like exercises and this laughing yoga thing, and you know, human interactions, social interactions, all these things help. My special guest this morning is Dr. Pim, and you're a laughing yoga instructor now? Mm, I guess you could say so, <laughs> <laughs> after my training in December. Yeah. You're fully qualified. Is, yep. it on, is it on your CV now? It is on my CV. <laughs> <laughs> Medical practitioner, laughing yoga instructor. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's in, right. In that order. So tell us a little bit about what people are going to expect on March the 9th. So um, people can just come without any equipment at all. And okay. then uh, we will be doing some like hand clapping exercise. And then we will just start laughing with like some daily poses and those kind of thing. So let's talk about the poses. So can you, I know we're on radio, so not everybody can see you, but we're going to video this and put it up <laughs> on our page. So do something that's going to okay. help me. So happy. do you, uh, do you like eating banana? Do you yes. eat banana? Okay. Yes. So we're, we're going to do a, laughing yoga banana pose okay okay so with one hand you pretend like you're holding a banana i can hold that and then right. now we're gonna peel the banana and as we peel we say a eh, a eh. eh. we peel again a eh. eh. one more a eh. eh. and one more a eh. eh. and now we put it in our mouth we mm -hmm. eat it and we laugh <laughs> <laughs> So such as that, <laughs> Dr. <For example>. Pim. <laughs> so that's one one pose that I like. <laughs> well, it's certainly making us laugh. Yeah. <laughs> like it's crazy, but it's actually quite good. Like mm -hmm. I'm really 
quite enjoying what you're talking about here. So how many people are going to be in a class, in this class? Um, well, I'm expecting maybe like 10, 20 people. Okay, so quite mm. small. Yep. And that's so that you can, you know, keep it more personal, yeah, more aligned. Yeah, keep, keep people laughing under control because yeah. you don't want to make it go out. Hey, what are you doing over there? Why are you <laughs> laughing so much? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now tell us, okay, it's on March the 9th. Mm -hmm. And where is it at? So it's going to be at a restaurant called Zen Bamboo. Okay. And this is like at the deep end of Soy 88. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so how do people find you? So I actually have a Facebook page okay. and it is called Ha 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 Laughing Yoga. No way. <laughs> yes. Is it Ha 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 Laughing Yoga? That's right. <laughs> you know what? I don't think anybody's going to forget that Facebook page. <laughs> That's why I called it that. <laughs> Genius, right? Genius. Well, I think what you're doing is quite interesting. It's the first time I've heard about it. And people, you know, you don't need to bring anything to this session. No, not right? at all. Not at all. And available to all ages. Ages. Yeah, all ages, all nationalities, just come and, yeah, willing to try some new things out. And you want to know how many people are coming, so they have to type yeah, a if, message if, you? Yeah, if they can, like, RSVP just on the event, which is on the Facebook page, okay. that would be great. Well, we'll put a post up on our Facebook page mm -hmm. as well, and we've been videoing us eating the banana <laughs> as well, so hopefully that will be okay. We'll put that up on our Facebook page all and right. share it with you as well. But thank you so much, Dr. Pim, for coming in mm -hmm. and chatting with me today. Like, I honestly cannot stop smiling. <laughs> You've brought joy to my world this morning. But thank you very much much right. and good luck with your event and, no, thank uh, you. and what's next for you in the future. Thanks, Dr. Phil. All right. Bye-bye.